Hi everybody, welcome. Welcome to step two of our wonderful step-by-step -step makeover. So traditionally, I always put concealer next, but as I've aged, I've noticed that I have more flaws. I'd be spending way too much time concealing before foundation. So what my recommendation is, is to switch those two steps and always start with foundation next. Then you'll use less concealer in step three. So um, my favorite foundation for day to day is Chris Cosmetics Mineral Sheer Tint, an all natural product that has an SPF of 20. It's super hydrating to add even more moisture to the skin and it has um, like a medium coverage and it glows. It's absolutely beautiful. I'm gonna also demonstrate another product called Cream Foundation um, after I've showed you how to use this. Because for times when you wanna have a little more polish and wanna have a little bit more of coverage on your skin, the Cream Foundation is going to be a great go-to. So for this, it works just like a moisturizer almost. So I am using the color Cameo Glow. So Cameo Glow is gonna be um, not our fairest color, um, but something in the middle. I have a little warmth in my skin right now. Um, if you have any questions, you can use our virtual artist program and we'll pick out the exact color match for you. So again, just like primer, I'm gonna massage it into my skin, but this time what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hit the areas I need the most coverage first. So I'm gonna go in through where my redness is. I'm gonna go up into this T area right here and definitely down in my chin. I'm gonna take it over my lips too. And while it's still goopy, I'm gonna do what we call a pre-conceal. I'm gonna go right under my eyes and get that party started with those dark circles and thin skin underneath the eyes. So once I have it all massaged, I'm good to go. Now, that other foundation I was telling you about, um, that's gonna give you a little bit more coverage. So if you need more coverage, you have more hyperpigmentation or you're trying to hide something, you know, pick up cream foundation. It's a cream compact foundation. It's cream, but it's oil-free, which is great, and there's no paraben in it. So this is our foundation brush. It's a flat top synthetic brush. It can be also used with our liquids. Um, but for this particular foundation, um, you're gonna just tap in and then go to the face in little downward stroking motions. Now, I sometimes even use this on top of my mineral sheer tint to go in and hide some of my red areas or if I'm having like a little blemish breakout, um, I'll just cover it. Sometimes my nose gets red or, you know, it gets red after a cold or whatever. So um, I can just finish up with this. Now this makes a great standalone concealer and foundation. So if you do end up getting uh, the cream foundation, you won't need a concealer because you can use this. So even with the brush, you could take it under the eyes and even around here and it's really quick, fast and easy. Okay, so that's foundation, downward strokes. Remember, skin cells point downward like shingles on a roof. So your best blend is in a downward stroking motion. Okay, so um, you just finished step two. So our next step will be step three, concealer. Great.